He chose him. Amen. He chose him. In the book of John chapter 15, 1 and 2, then we will now go to around 16 or so. John 15, 1 and 2. John 15, 1 and 2. Is there, are you having an issue with your sister? I am the true vine, and my father is the husbandman too. Every branch in me that beareth not fruit, he taketh away. And every branch that beareth fruit, he purgeth it, that it may bring forth more fruit. Can you go to 16, please? Ye have not chosen me, but I have chosen you and ordained you that ye should go and bring forth fruit and that your fruit should remain, that whatsoever ye shall ask of the Father in my name, he may give it you. The chosen. The chosen. This message God has just put in my heart for somebody here today, or somebody that is listening to me right now. Somebody that has been wondering what could have been happening to you, to you all this while. But peradventure is because you have been chosen. When you are talking about divine, <coughs> or the husband man, or a gardener, whenever you go along some paths, or some places that they are gardeners that normally take care of the flower. You will see something with the gardener. Knife. Or all these big scissors. I don't know what they call, call it. But they keep on trimming and trimming and shaping the flower. And sometimes those flowers bleed. When you see some white, white and liquid, that's their own blood, I guess. So they bleed. Let me say that when you are chosen for you to bring forth small fruit, the father prunes. The pruning process is not always palatable. What is to be chosen? Whenever you are talking about being chosen, <coughs> meaning that there are series of um, options or alternatives, and one is picked out. And the tendency for the one that is being picked out to be rejoicing is I. Because that means that I am special. Among all the people, I am special. But the truth about being chosen is that it's good. But it has a price. It has a price. Some of us may be going through that pain, that price now. I mean, I won't be. If truly I've been chosen, how am I going through this? That is part of the price of being chosen. You know, whenever there is an audition, maybe you want to choose somebody for a role in a film, or maybe to even represent the nation. There will be a lot of people that will come and they will start knocking them out. At the end of the day, after much has been said and done, they will not choose somebody for that particular character. But that happened to be the beginning <coughs> of sleepless night. Beginning of training. Beginning of rehearsal. And all those things, they are not always palatable. Just like this one that they do in Nigeria. Good ultimate search. By the time they will eventually choose the maybe 10 or 12 people. They will throw party for them. And they say, these are the ones. The next thing they are sending them to the jungle. And in the midst of them trying to win maybe 10 million or a car or whatever the price will be, some of them cry. Some of them, you will see, they will be fine with anger. They, 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 they will not even care anymore. The you way know, they will be looking. That is the price for being chosen. I remember when I gave admission into the university. I was so happy. I, 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 vividly, I, 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 I can still remember that day. I was jumping up those days on my bed. I am going to the university. Very good. But after a while, when I was going through the 
the university. It was not that palatable. When the, my first semester hit me hard, <coughs> I failed chemistry 101. I now started remembering how I felt. I was not feeling that way, that particular time anymore. But it was just because I've been chosen. Many people did not want the opportunity of coming to They are not chosen. So they will not be going through what I was going to lecture in the morning, going to read overnight, going to prepare for an examination. But they, they will not need to do that. But because you have been chosen, you will go through some things. That is what we are saying. That's why you have to say that don't count it strange when you are going through some things. It's because of you being chosen. Job was chosen. God was discussing with Satan in Job chapter 1, 8 to 12. He said, Have you considered my servant Job? <laughs> of all the people in the world, I trust him. And the Lord said, Uncle Satan, Have thou considered my servant Job? And that there is none like him in the earth. A perfect and an upright man. One that fell God and enjoyed him. The next thing, maybe you can go to 11 and 12. Satan said, Is this for nothing that he, he failed you? God said, Okay, if you want to try, go and try. But he's my chosen. Chosen people in the world, they go to you. Zechariah and Elizabeth, they were chosen. He said that in, in Luke chapter 1, 5 to 7, Luke chapter 1, he said that they were righteous before God. But because they were chosen to bring forth a child that must come six months before Jesus Christ, they were plagued with violence, but they were made to appear by because a time has been set and that time will not come before that time. And they must not bring forth anything, regardless of what they go where to go to before that time. They were chosen. There, there was in the day of Herod, the king of Judea, a certain priest named Zechariah, of the cause of Abia. And his wife was the daughter of Herod, and her name was Elizabeth. And they were put to right short, not before man. Before God Himself, so it's not that we know that God has done something, something in the past. Before God, walking in all the commandments and ordinances of the Lord, blameless, so, and they had no child because Elizabeth was married, and they both were now were speaking in aid. For it had been said that they would bring forth John the Baptist. And that time had been set before they were born. In fact, when God was creating the world, He was already setting before a long time. Revelation chapter 13, verse 8, you see there. The Bible says that the lamb has been slain from the foundation of the earth. That lamb happened to be Jesus Christ. Has been slain from the foundation of the earth. Meaning that God has planned that Jesus Christ will die for the world. But somebody that must come before Jesus Christ will come six months before him. So before they were far more, it has been said. And regardless of the time that they have been waiting, let it come any more, they must just wait six months before that time. But it's because they have been chosen. That's why you have to go through that period of delay. In the book of Matthew 11, 11, Matthew 11, 11 the town told us the kind of child. John the Baptist was. We have said that among all the people that are born of women, he was the greatest. Sometimes, when you have to bring forth a very great or glorious destiny, as he told him, there will be a price. There will be a price. Are you going to your own price? Joseph, he saw a glorious destiny, <clears throat> but the price must go to prison. He must lie on me. He must go to injustice. He must be different things will happen to him. Yes, he was happy. Among all my father's children, it's only me that he gave coat of many colors. Uh, the chosen, very good. But the jungle experience is about to come. God chose Rebecca to break a record. Nobody has brought for twins before in life. 
We said, ah, I'm not going to be me. You bring one that will be this for. In book of Genesis 25, 22 to 24. Genesis 25, 22. When she started going through the pregnancy, ah, it was disturbing her so much. She said, why am I feeling like this? Ah, oh, God said, like, because you have been told this. <laughs> and the children struggled together. <clears throat> we did that. And she said, if it be so, why am I thus? Am I feeling like this? I'm not feeling like I'm feeling frustration. What are you? And she went to inquire of the Lord. And the Lord said unto her, Two nations are in their womb, and two manner of people shall be separated from their power. And the one people shall be stronger than the other people, and the elder shall serve the younger. 24. And when Alex to be delivered were fulfilled, behold, there were twins in her womb for the very first time. So because she had to break a record, she had to pay the price of going through issues. <laughs> Praise the Lord. <clears throat> God has sent me here to tell someone that I chosen. Are you feeling and saying, what? Am I the only person in this world? My trouble and faster is because you are chosen. And when you are chosen, you go through issues. There will be glory at the end. But that issue, you must necessarily go through it. In the book of First Peter chapter 4, 12 and 13. First Peter chapter 4, 12 and 13. Apostle Peter was encouraging us as the chosen people that be not take it not strange concerning the fairy trial, which is to try you. He not think that it, will not, it must try you. As though some strange things are prone unto you. 13. But rejoice. In as much as ye are partaker of Christ's sufferings, that when his glory shall be revealed, ye may be glad also with what? Exceeding joy. Your season of joy has come. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. For it does to know that when you are chosen, you must go through issue. May you were chosen. Imagine that will bring forth. Ah, which one is this kind of? Which kind of lady is this one? This one was the special. An angel was sent directly to ah that you are the one among all the women in the world. You are the one that we are chosen. You are the most highly favored and good. Ah, when he started coming, when you are chosen, how will you explain to the world that you did not make a man for this pregnancy? The price of being chosen. He got to a time. The fact that she was chosen to bring forth an unusual child, it now made it difficult for her to even have access to the child. One day she wanted to see Jesus. The Bible said that she was outside and they sent a message to Jesus who was teaching the temple, your mother and your brother, they want to see you. Let them wait. These are my brethren for, for now. The price of being chosen. And you are remembered. Ah, my time is here. This is a special time. But not just special for you. The price of being chosen. I remember this story <coughs> of um, a past head of state in this country, Mr. Mohammed. He was assassinated. But one thing about this assassination, I'm not even talking about the per se, but he was assassinated using a particular car. Message 230.6. The other message 230.6 in that time. But if you could hear the voices of those cats, they would be envious of the message that was carrying the president. But because that car, among all that car, when they went to the showroom, said, This is the one who picked for the president. And you will be rejoicing. After a while came the bullet. Because that you chosen to carry the president, there will be price. And maybe other ones will have said, see that this one has been chosen. And this one has still been driven around. And they just moved it aside. The glass is shattered, the tire deflated, and it don't pass this away. But after a while, you know what happened? They now went and carried that car. I moved it to National Trade Stadium. It's still there now. And they started cleaning it, decorating it as tourist objects. 
every year over 3,000 people visit that place to see this happen to be the car that carries the former head of state. All that cars, I hardly see Mezi Suke around now. They have been long forgotten. But because it was chosen, it went through you. But it got to a time that till today is still celebrated. Are you going to any age? Don't worry, it's because you have been chosen. Like Job, like Joseph. You will pass through that place and you will enter to your place of glory. Amen. In the book of 1 Peter chapter 5. 9 and 10. 1 Peter chapter 5, 9 and 10. And I round up. Who resist steadfast in faith, knowing that the same affliction are accomplished in your brethren. Okay, can you go start from it? Let, let's start from it. Let's start from it so that we so that because of your adversary is devil. As a running lion, walking about seeking whom he may devour. Who resist steadfastly in the faith, knowing that the same afflictions are accomplished in your brethren that are in the world. Ten. But the God of all grace, who has called us unto his eternal glory by Christ Jesus. That ye have suffered a while, make you perfect, establish, strengthen, and settle you. This is the end result of every chosen. Jesus was chosen on the cross by the end of the day, he was given a name above all day. Job was chosen. God was bragging with him. Now, when two series of issues at the end of the day, the rest of that God gave him twice. Elizabeth and they were, they were chosen. They now have to go to period of deprivation just because God chose them that you be the one that will bring forth. When you are chosen, whether in auditioning, there will be going to. Are you going to just endure? Because after this has come your period of glory. Amen. I really like to have faith and say, Father, Father, please help me in the choice that you have made concerning my life. And let my moment of glory moment of start quickly in the name of Jesus. Help me. Help me. Help me. Be just to tell you what you are going through so that you won't consider it too strange. <coughs> Thank you, Father. In Jesus' mighty name, we are praying. Amen. Father, Father, we thank you for your word that has come. You said that whoever brings food, you know, food more, and the food in process is not always very palatable. But you said that so that you bring forth more food. Father, grant us the grace to go through what we need to go through and to get to where we need to get to. Yes. In the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Father. Thank you. In Jesus' name we have prayed.